is 25 cents. Thanks. Let's see what's in the news. Huh? Hmm. There's a hole in the middle again. It must have gotten torn when I pulled it from the vending machine. Sorry. Oh, that's the third time this week that some hooligan has ripped the newspaper from your mouth. Flight 919's been hijacked, right in midair. I'm glad we're not on it. Mort, the chief was returning from Kalasper on that flight. We gotta do something. You're right, there's no time to lose. Great, straight on the job. Huh? I smell trouble. If Mr. L's been hijacked, he'll be gone for a while, and it would be a great shame to let his malt whiskey go to waste. The TIA should open an office in New Guinea and send those two there. Don't be like that! I thought you liked a drink! How am I supposed to read the news when there's a hole in the middle of the paper? Oh. What? I'm gonna turn on the TV to watch the news. Oh? Ha! Hmm. This huh? is the morning news on Channel 2. Chief Tender of the United Nations will not be sitting in council today due to a painful boil. And huh? now... Hey, what's going oh. on? Oh. What have you done to my television? Oh. What's happened to it? It was the what Dodgers! What are you talking about? When the Dodgers hit a home run, I gave the set a kick. Oh, I see. The Dodgers broke my TV, did they? I've never Ooh, seen anyone get so excited over a TV! Idiot. I gotta hear the news. I'll try it. The radio. And now, tennis. Japan's mm -hmm. Paddy O'Hara was defeated in straight sets today. Come here, Mort. No, oh, yes, boss. You see, when the TV stopped working, I listened to your radio. When the Dodgers hit another home run, hmm. I got so excited, I threw the radio out of the window. Ah. Oh! I gotta hear the news, Beast Face. Give me a radio, huh? No way. You've got your own radio huh. and TV. Not to mention the newspaper that Mort brings you every day. My radio, my television, my newspaper. Ow! Oh, what's gotten into the boss today? He's so bad-tempered. The hijacker has demanded that the aircraft land in the city today to refuel before going on to Greenland. This is just the opportunity we need. We can rescue Mr. Rell and arrest the hijacker. Mort, why are you in disguise? Well, I thought I'd better put this on in case you found your portable TV set, you portable see? Portable TV oh. set? Oh, no! Please! No! I had a feeling I should have kept my Tin Man outfit on. Whoa! Come on, Mort, we gotta get to the airport and rescue Mr. Rell. TIA! Oh. The hijacker has made more demands. Only airport officials are allowed to refuel the plane, or he's gonna blow it off the face of the earth! Okay, Mort, this is the plan. We'll drive the truck to the plane and pretend to refuel it. Then we break in on scene, overpower the hijacker, and rescue the chief. Great idea! Try not to look like a TIA agent. I'll put on my dumb expression. <laughs> I wonder which one of these holes is connected to the fuel tank. Just leave it to me, boss. It's easy. I've seen him do this on the movies. Now, I'll just open this valve and the gasoline will be flowing into the tanks before you know it. I don't believe it. That idiot from the TIA is pumping gasoline into the drinking water system. Hey, try another hole, Mort. I'm gonna oh. look for a way to get in. Well, it's gone in there somewhere. Huh? Ooh. I've unscrewed the emergency exit box so we can sneak in. Are you sure that's the emergency exit? Yeah, yeah. sure. <laughs> Some fool has blocked the emergency exit with all this luggage. It's a good job we cleared it for them. It could have been dangerous. That dumb klutz can't be trusted to do anything. Now what's he up to? Mort! I'm over here, boss. I found this blowtorch on the truck, and I'm cutting a hole in the fuselage so we can get inside. Huh? But the airplane is soaked with gasoline! I don't know what you're complaining about, Chief. At least we rescued you from that nasty hijacker. Mort, get back here and find him. I can guess who's gonna be in the pot we coffin it If he catches me, I'm instant lobster they stolen a small plane? Right, we're on our way. Mort, Bill, get in here! We've got an important mission! All those poor little secret agents, they're fast asleep. They look like sleeping angels. Huh? They sleep so soundly, even these hammer blows can't disturb them. Now wake them gently. Wakey, wakey! Ah! Wake up, you've got an important mission over at the airport. Now! The hijacker escaped from the police and stole a small plane. He's gonna try and leave the country. Now your mission is to stop him. Oh no, Saints preserve us, it's them again. Well, is it ready? Yes, huh? sir, your plane's ready. The hijacker's headed for Madagascar. I take it that you two can fly? Are you kidding? My uncle used to be a crash test pilot, taught me. And I used to be a kite flying champion. Well, get after that hijacker. Hello, Control? I hope you're well insured. Yeah, but not enough for those two idiots. Where's the controls? Well, try looking in the cockpit. Thanks for the tip. There they are. Urgh, I'm getting out of the way. Ready, boss? Mm-hmm. 
Okay, it's in first gear. I'll be safe in here. That's funny. We seem to be going backwards. Mm. Oh, watch where you're going. Oh! Oh! We better get out of here. That was Mr. M's car. He won't be cross. He's really quite attached to us. He's attached to us, all right. His tie is stuck in the rudder. Try moving the rudder, Mort. It might just shake him off. When I get hold of you two, you'll wish you'd never been born. <laughs> Come back here. Did we lose him, boss? Well, put it this way. He's no longer on the passenger list. Hey, Mort, get her up, get her up. We're heading straight to the restaurant. Uh, this tube's coming out, and a plate's going in. Huh? Oh! I hope you don't think I'm rude, dear, but isn't that a bit too big? We lost the wheel, hey, don't worry, we got another one. We're on auto -bike. Okay! Gee, yeah. boss, this is real fun. You should try it. What are they doing? They've lost control. I think we're losing some height. Hey. Whoa! They've looped the loop. Oh, wow! Uh, now they're coming this way. Oh, no! Ah, ah, ah. We just stole Mr. L's jacket and wallet. Then he's always telling us he's broke. First it's my tie, then my jacket. I'm getting out of here before they take my pants. Do you see what I see, boss? Down there, I think it must be the hijacker. Let's get him! Curses are onto me. I'll shake him off in the clouds. Oh, that hurt. Ooh. He doesn't lose me that easily. I'll get right, him. Right, let's go! Boy, that was some climb. Still, I'll be safe high up on this mountain away from those two crackpots. escapes to freedom. The search goes on for the kamikaze pilots who nearly killed the head of the TIA. Where are they? Maybe we should give ourselves up, huh, boss? No, you stay in disguise. Need that word. Don't even think about it, you cross-eyed cock. Oh. Hello, is that the airport manager? This is the chief of the TIA. Any developments? Why, yes, my brand new Frank Douglas DC-20 has disappeared. Tarnation, did it have much fuel? Hardly any at all. Huh? Good, that means it won't get very far. Don't worry, I'll find it for you. <laughs> Mort, Phil, I want to see you in here right away. You've got ten seconds, starting now. Hmm. Hmm. Mort, Phil! Now they've got me angry. What are you doing in here? Didn't you hear me calling you? Strike! <laughs> Sorry about that, Chief. Are you okay? No, I'm not. Thanks to you, I got a nose like a beetroot. Looks more like a pumpkin. Hey, Chief, would you like a game of bowls? Come on, pitch a few. Yeah, why not? You can use my ball. But I don't need it. I got one. I got someone to bowl it for me, too. Mm -hmm. Okay, champ, strike them out for me. No problem. No. No. Stay right, too. Oh. All right, enough of these stupid games. I've got an urgent mission for you, too. A Frank Douglas DC-20 airplane has been stolen from the airport. It must be the hijacker again. It hasn't got much fuel in it, so it'll have to make an emergency landing somewhere. Your job is to search the surrounding fields and find that aircraft. How are we going to travel over those bumpy fields, huh? This key will open Hangar 9. Inside, you'll find some special transport for making aerial surveillance, so get to it! I wonder what it's gonna be. A jump jet or maybe a turbine-propelled helicopter? Huh, some flying oh. machine! I guess this is Mr. L's idea of a joke! Hold tight! Oh. Yeah, Morton Phil, they're on a surveillance mission. Can't oh. you go any oh. faster? Oh. Listen, Buster, how'd you like my beak in your eye? Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Agent Gossip Face, now will be the laughing stock of the TIA. <laughs> Wait till I tell the boys. It's diving! They must have seen something to eat! Whoa. Hey, look, it's Nest! Oh, yeah, there's another stork at home. I guess it must be his wife! Whoa. Whoa. It's bringing something back, boss! Yeah, but what? We'll soon find out! Oh no, lady, you got the wrong idea. I'm not hungry! Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> I'm not hanging around to have a worm shoved down my throat. I'm getting out of here right now! On second thoughts, maybe eating a worm would have been better. That was disgusting. No way am I sticking around for dessert. Ow! Mort, oh. we've got to find a way of getting that dumb bird down. Consider it done. Huh? I've got the perfect disguise. He won't be able to resist this. Get ready to jump, huh? boss. Whoa! He thinks I'm an uchi baby. Whoa! <laughs> this is no time to have an attack of the hiccups. I want to see my partner. Get me down there! <laughs> Any bright ideas? No. Mm, well, yeah. I'll send him a message on the wing. Remember, Mort, that bird is government property. Don't damage him. I won't. I'll just send him a general reminder that we need a ride. Airmail. 
What a great shot! I got that dumb bird right in the back of the neck! He won't give us any more trouble. As soon as he wakes up, we can get going. Okay. We're back on the job. Right, let's fly. We gotta find that aircraft, Mort. Mr. Elm's depending on us. Ow, my back's getting sore. Well, try standing up. You know, like riding on a subway. That's better. My butt was getting really sore. Oh. Ow! Huh? Mort, take us down. <laughs> <laughs> That's some partridge I hit there. Look at him falling. <laughs> Why are you trying to catch that butterfly? Hunting partridges is huh? too dangerous, really? you know. I'm afraid we haven't been able to find your Frank Douglas DC-20 anywhere. It's okay, fellas. It turned up. It was taken by my nephew. Nephew? Yeah, it's my cigar lighter. It had a few drops of fuel in it, and I was worried about him burning himself. That's why I reported it. <laughs> it's dangerous to feed the animals. Get me out of here! Yes, Mr. L, right away, sir. Hello, Morty. How lovely to see you, you gorgeous hunk. What are you doing down there? I scuffed my shoe, so I'm covering it with this stuff. See? That's my very expensive French mascara. I thought it was black ink. Sorry. Oh, I said it was sorry. That hmm? mascara came from one of Paris's most famous beauty parlors. It cost me $100. An ugly woman and her money are easily parted. I'm going to complain about your partner. Hmm? What's he done, Ophelia? I'm too upset to discuss it. All I will say is Mr. L's waiting to see you and that idiot Mark. What's the matter? What are you doing with my Ow. little perfume? Yes. I'm sorry, Ophelia. I thought it was fly killer. It smells like burnt toast. My perfume as a fly killer? <laughs> Peasant huh? Philistine! Look, can we talk? <laughs> Shall we go in? Yeah, quick. Okay. Hello, Chief. You wanted to see us? Believe me, if I had a choice, I'd take it. I want you to get back to the airport straight away and take off for Bago. Will they lend us another plane? Or should we just imitate that stork and flap our arms? Don't be ridiculous. You're booked on the 315 flight. Our spies inform me that a suspicious-looking character has booked a ticket, and it might be that hijacker again. I want you to find him and arrest him. You... Oh, oof. Come on, Mort. The plane's waiting to take off. We better hurry. I told you we should have got a taxi cab. What a meanie. Hmm. Hurry, Mort, I think we've upset the stewardess. No. <laughs> what time do you call this? I'm glad you two could make it. Now we have a whole herd. Oops, I mean the passenger list is full and we can take off. Why don't you let me help you remove the gangway? I think a little kick should do it. No! Ah. Oh, oh. <laughs> don't worry, boss, I've got her. Now, what do I do with her? Oh. You know something, boss? The stewardess hasn't even bothered to thank me for moving the gangway. Don't worry about the door. I'll shut it. Oh, that's real nice of you, boss. I'm sure she'll appreciate that gesture. Huh? What's wrong, lady? You got a cramp or something? Oh, you dropped my fingers! Oh, just get in your seat and fasten your belt. I don't want to hear another word out of you! No need to shout. This is your captain speaking. Welcome to Fresh Airways. We hope you have a pleasant flight. Oh, I mean flight. We'll be landing at Bago at 6.15. That is if we can get the landing gear working. <laughs> Go and check the passengers, Mort, and try and be as inconspicuous as possible, okay? Leave it to me, boss. What I need is some black coffee. Ah! <laughs> Help! There's huh? a monster in the cupboard! Ah! Hey, boss! My bird disguise scared the stewardess and she Ooh. fainted. But it's okay, I went to the galley and got her a drink to freshen her up a little bit. Uh, oh, he got you washing up liquid. Uh, oh. I need water. Oh. I'll go and check the cockpit and see if the captain's okay. Good, everything's nice and quiet. Whoa! <laughs> You turned off the autopilot. I'll straighten her out manually. There's oh. someone at the door, Captain. I'll let them in. I think she's suffering from air sickness. She's obviously in the wrong job. Don't worry, lady. I'll help you get back on your feet. Oh, oh dear, your ties come off. I think the airline should make your uniforms a bit stronger. Don't do it! I gotta jump. I can't take anymore. Oh. 
Look at that, Mort. They're practicing emergency procedures. <laughs> <laughs> Your joke must be a bundle of laughs, huh, girls? Always meeting new, exciting people and traveling to and from one exotic place or another. You're lucky. Oh, oh Gertrude, I don't wow. think you should be doing that. Put them down. A stewardess who threw two passengers from an aircraft claimed that mental stress was to blame. What did you do to that poor unfortunate woman on the plane to make her throw you off? I'm telling you, Mr. Rell, she was nuttier than a fruitcake. You gotta believe us, Chief. She just flipped for no reason at all and threw us out the door with no parachute. What's that? You've seen the hijacker in the airport departure lounge? Don't worry, sir. I'll send over my two agents right away. Yes, that's right. Morton Phil. No, I can't send you two Marines. What? You're gonna make out your will? Come, come, I think you're exaggerating. I know they're a bit scatterbrained, but they're really down-to-earth fellas. Mort, Phil, get in here as quickly as you can. Uh, oh, 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 you in disguise, you idiot? Uh, That's not even a decent disguise you're wearing. But it's very practical, Chief. There's fresh cement on the floor. Oh, no, I got my new patent shoes on. They cost me a hundred bucks. <laughs> Are you trying out a new disguise, too? No, sir. I'm hard at work. The floors look a bit cracked, so I'm laying some new ones. <laughs> Charming. Next time, get a professional and see how much he charges you. All right, you pea brains, listen up. The hijacker has been seen at the airport again. Go and arrest him and no mistakes this time. He might have a gun. What do we do if he pulls out a 44, mm. huh? Ooh. This belt has a very powerful magnet attached to the buckle which will attract all metals. So if he does pull a gun on you, it'll instantly leap from his hand to your belt. It can't fail. Dr. Bacterium invented it, you see? Oh, that guy's a loony, Chief. I'm not wearing it. You know the Chief likes Bacterium. <laughs> you know I think he's absolutely brilliant. <laughs> oh, this new walking stick is made of metal, Grandpa. So be a lot safer than your old bamboo one. Thank you, Sonny. Oh. <laughs> Grandpa, who did this to you? That hooligan oh. stole my new cane. Oh. I didn't steal it. Oh. It flew at me. I'm telling you, I'm innocent. Oh. Put me down. Now you put it on. I can't wear it. I've got a very sensitive belly button. Oh, <laughs> all right, all right. I'll put it on. <laughs> I feel really stupid. This belt doesn't match my coat at all. Well, if it ain't my old friend Mort, I ain't seen you in ages. Let's go for a drink. Oh. 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 Hey, Mort, where did that guy get to? That wasn't very funny, Morton. Wait till I get hold of you. They don't call me the butcher for nothing. Quit your moaning and get down from that lamppost, Mort. Look what you've done to it. That'll come out of you ages. No! Oh, I've had enough of this belt. Let's get rid of it. <laughs> Holy cow, a stainless steel tooth. Now, where did that come from, I wonder, huh? Oh, is it yours? Hey, that's incredible. What a clean extraction. Ow! Oh. Come on, we better get oh. attention to the airport. Oh! That belt of yours is a menace, you punk. What a grouch! Yeah, we only trashed his meter. Now to find that hijacker. I know it's a filthy habit, boss, but I've got to have a cigarette. <laughs> Whoa! No! Ah. <laughs> hey, take it easy, boss. This is no time for a shower. Oh, oh, guys. It's the hijacker! I the rib or something. Well, you ain't gonna catch me. Oh. Oh, it's a hand grenade. Relax, boss. The pin's still in. What's oh. going on here? What's all the commotion? Well, um... Don't worry, sir. Your problem will soon be over. We found the hijacker. He had a bomb on him, but we disarmed him. Look, here it is. That's the pin! Oh. Oh. An explosion rocked the city airport today, injuring the director and two nincompoops from the TIA. Come here, you snake in the grass. Look, it was an honest mistake. The pin just came out of my hand. Your tail's gonna come out of my hands when I get a hold of it. I knew you I should have got the Marines involved. You're At least they wouldn't have blown me up. You two dummies! We seem to spend our whole life here. We're gonna nail that hijacker once and for all. But wait, he knows what we look like now, so we better put on a disguise, huh? Oh yeah, that's a great idea. All passengers for the Banana Airways flight to Cincinnati by Mongolia, please go to gate 77 and board your plane at once. Your meal during the flight will be a night rat! Disgusting! Disgraceful! I want to change airlines. <laughs> Gee, what a noise. Come on, Mort. I've just seen the hijacker. Mort, where is he? Mort? Oh, I've just seen something horrible. I pulled the chain and the whole system fell on my head. Then I got up and ran off. I'm not drunk. I promise it really happened in here. Well, that's the last time I used this disguise. That guy nearly pulled my nose off back there. Okay, forget it. I've just seen our man boarding a B-Wing 797. Let's go and flush him out. Come on, Mort. Let's go! I'll pretend to be the co-pilot. What? Oh, right. You're late again. Sit down. I think you've made a mistake, Captain. You see, I'm not really the... 
No, don't make excuses to me. You college boys are all the same. You think you know it all, don't you? It's time to take off. Now just sit there and stop the engines. Give me full thrust and get those flaps moving. Okay, here goes. You dummy, that's a cigar lighter. Now turn the radar on. Is this a switch? Oh! oh. Well, I don't think that's the radar. Hey, how do you control this thing? This is flight control to B-Wing 797. What's happening up there, buddy? You're heading in the wrong direction. Hey, the aircraft's coming in a bit low. Pull up. Pull up. You're heading right forward. Can't you hear me? I talk. This is control tower to B-Wing 797. I don't know who you are, but I don't like you. Gee, what a grouch. Still, I think I better try landing again. Time to spring into action. Ha-ha, this is a hijack. Now then, let's see what this does. Whoa! too low. Get up. I'll try again. Hey, this is a hijack. <laughs> I can see the runway. Start to descend. Okay, boss. Not too fast. Or... Whoa, hey, slow down. Whoa. It's good manners to knock before you come in. The hijacker. Oh, hijacker. <laughs> You're mistaken. I'm Leonardo da Vinci. <laughs> he's flipped. Crazy. But he's got concussions, so what's your excuse, boss? Just keep your eyes on the runway. Okay, take it easy. Control tower to B-Wing 797. You're coming in too fast to land. Reduce your speed. Listen to whoever's flying that thing. You haven't even put your landing gear down. What's the matter with you up there? Look out. You've got one wingtip dragging along the runway. Pull up. Pull up. You're gonna crash. You're gonna crash. Uh-oh. Seven, I hate you. Oh, there's the rest of the passengers. <sighs> they probably want to thank us personally, Mort, for getting them back down safe. Drama at the city airport today. A B-Wing 797 nukes the control tower. A hijacker is apprehended and an angry crowd beat two TIA agents to a pulp. It's nice to know Mr. L really cares about us. Yeah, he said he's got a surprise waiting for us, too. What a great guy. <laughs>